for a celebration of ice sculptures in Wayne County. It's called Crystal Cabin Fever. And as News Watch 16's Brittany Boyer reports, one family escaped the ice to get to the ice in Lakeville. If you're looking to get a glimpse of the world and you don't want to go too far, a business in Wayne County is bringing it to you. Sculpted Iceworks in Lakeville kicked off its annual Crystal Cabin Fever after several weeks of ice carving. The first block was about a month ago, so it's about 800 blocks of ice, about 100 tons of ice. This year's Crystal Cabin Fever event takes you around the world, from the Eiffel Tower to Egypt to even the Colosseum in Rome. We were here last year. It was absolutely wonderful. And this Rick Kalp and his family made the last minute trip here after Wednesday's storm left almost half an inch of ice in Chester County, leaving them without power. I grabbed uh, my wife and uh, my son and his family. We came up the turnpike last night and we had a warm bed to sleep in at Lake Wall and Paw Pack. Kalp's grandkids didn't seem to mind leaving the ice at home to come here and play with even more ice. I love it. I want to own everything made out of ice in here. And even though it might be colder inside here at Cabin Fever than it is outside, that doesn't mean you can't have fun. And by fun, I mean down the ice slide. <laughs> it's sort of like fast and also a little bit bumpy. And if all that action and adventure leaves you hungry, there's also a snack bar and an ice bar just bundle up. It stays really cold in this building, so bring snow pants and, uh, you know, dress warm for sliding down the slide. Even if it's a beautiful day, it's going to be winter inside here. Crystal Cabin Fever runs through February 23rd in Lakeville. Brittany Boyer, Newswatch 16, Wayne County. That Jimmy Coles.